Yeah, okay, I'm trying to be interesting, you know. My video is at about three views after 20 years. With my very secret plan, I might somehow kind of think that things aren't going well, but that's not the case. It just appears that way. All of you naysayers, all of you haters, all the people who don't think Captain Sweep's plan has any type type of teeth, that nothing's happening. Mm, you're missing so much, so much. The actual people in the plan are just slowly waking up to the fact that they may be in the very secret plan and they are characters and players in it because that's a big piece of this plan. Imagine making a plan, a great plan, freaking incredible plan inviting all these people that you know in it and they don't even take you seriously they don't even help they don't do nothing you think captain sweet might get a little annoyed a little bit upset the problem is the mind we have this conscious mind we have this unconscious mind and in the unconscious mind are all the patterns that stop us from being exactly who and what we're supposed to be but we don't even know that these programs just keep running in the unconscious mind and we think everything's fine oh yeah the unconscious kind of like the subconscious could be the same thing but sometimes we interrelate the words but it doesn't really matter okay so what are you going to do about this mind what how do we get these people in the very secret plan to wake up to the fact that they are superheroes and that we can actually take over this planet can't press a button frick that said we have to approach things a little bit differently so i'm like captain sweep i'm the storyteller narrator of the very secret plan and you are the audience you are the people out there who are going okay we'll watch this web tv show we'll see what's going on and maybe maybe at some point along the way you're gonna go wait that's a good idea that's a great plan and i'm going to jump in you see that's the point you the viewing audience has to help us get a whole bunch of money for us oh wait that's always the hidden agenda this isn't the hidden agenda this is the actual real agenda we have 20 people and they all are going to get a million dollars to put into a project that is going to change the world for the better and all these projects are going to be connected together in the very secret plan and the inflow matrix operating system now remember whenever you hear the word inflow matrix you have to say it in a funny voice you cannot say inflow matrix in a normal voice because if you are then you're not in the very secret plan there are certain rules to be in the very secret plan and that is the first rule of the very secret plan got it get it good all of us want peace of mind you know it's like the most important thing we want to be calm we want to enjoy life we want to be able to enjoy life but if there are things that are stopping us from enjoying life maybe we have to do something about it right 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 <laughs> oh there's a lot i gotta tell you there's a lot that's been going on but it's gonna take a while so this is like a lifetime long plan. This is a yearly long plan. This is like a lunar day plan. This is a day like plan. This is a seasonal plan. This in fact is an hourly plan. I do happen to think that it could be minute to minute. It could be present in this moment and perhaps an even timeless plan. Like think about that. Nine levels of plan. Do you have more than one level of plan? What's your plan? Tell me your plan. And then maybe I'll tell you my plan. We'll compare the two plans and then we'll see which is the better plan. Whatever is the better plan, we'll work on together and we can integrate the plans together. But if you don't have a plan and your plan is actually like, well, maybe, maybe you should pay attention to Captain Sweep's plan, right? <laughs> no, I don't want to. I don't like Captain Sweep. I don't want to go on his plan. He's trying to get me to do things I don't want. No, 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 no. Whiners. I hate whiners. There's a few things I also have to tell you about what's not in the plan. No, whiners. I'm not going to go there, okay? There's certain things you don't go because anyone hates you. So let's just keep things right in the middle. Let's keep things straight as an arrow. 
because I know that some of these people on the plan, you know, they think Captain Sweep's a little too eccentric. Think he's a little strange. Don't want to be associated with Captain Sweepum. Yeah. What do you think about that? Hmm? Exactly. Person's got to have some character. Person's got to have some style. Person's got to have some presentation. And I have these things. That is why I came up with the plan. <laughs> oh, yes. Oh, yes. Years and years. Oh, gosh. Yeah. Map and map and while everyone else was having a good time. While everyone else was prancing about doing your thing, Captain Sweep was working. Working! Do you hear that, Zamir? Working! I'm not upset. I'm not holding any resentments against anybody. <laughs> you little dandies. <sighs> Moving around like a little... <laughs> There's just certain things that kind of get to Captain Sweet and I lose it. And I, I just know that I do that and I have to come back to center. Come back to peace of mind. Come back to... The world as it is, Captain Sweep, because you live in a world that's very idealistic. You live in a world where you have all these maps and you think they're supposed to come true. But that isn't the way that it is. I mean, look at this. You got this building. You got this building filled with politicians. These politicians say, this is the way it is. And then we're supposed to go along with these politicians that are just grabbing the money from our pockets and uh, 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 okay that's one of these moments i think they call this the shadow i think they i think they call this the shadow <laughs> i need to go back to hobbiton i need to, I need to breathe 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 Shake. Shaking calms Captain Sweep. It's the only real thing that can calm Captain Sweep when he gets going. Because I gotta say that I don't have much emotional control. I would like to think I do, but I don't. And I lose it when something's off. And I get really pissed when something's wrong. And as you can imagine, that happens quite a lot in the very secret plan. And this sort of can upset people because I may like throw them off the plan, throw them off the ship, throw them somewhere. And people just don't seem to like that. They want to talk about beer and potatoes. They want to garden and have a nice little life in Hobbiton. But sometimes Gandalf shows up <laughs> and he goes, guys, uh, there's a thing called Mordor over here. And they have these kind of like dark riders and they're going to come to get you and destroy your entire existence that you do not know that is going to happen. I'm here to tell you this. I'm a wizard. I'm here to warn you. I'm here to tell you. I'm here to go, guys, there's something off here. There's something really off, but you're not listening. Mordor exists, and there's an adventure on the horizon. But who's going to take the ring? Who's going to take the ring? Is it going to be you? Who will protect the ring bearer? Is it you? Who is after the ring bearer? These guys don't play nice at all. And what about the love story? What really is the ring? The very secret plan is an adventure where people come together to save the world. Everybody likes a pot of gold. Why not a million dollars? Funny stuff has been happening on this planet. Lots of things don't seem to be what they say they are. This is the beginning. 
this is the start. This is the start of the Very Secret Plan web TV show, which is going to come to you every week. And every week you're going to see progress by the characters in the Very Secret Plan making progress towards their dreams. First, it's going to start by a two minute report from each of the 20 people. That's it. They can do whatever they want in the two minutes. I can maybe edit them all together in ways that I like. And I can put in my little additions as the storyteller. And perhaps I get 10 minutes at the beginning, maybe 10 minutes at the end, and I get to talk a lot while all these people don't. <laughs> oh, I'm not supposed to say that, am I? But you see, I have the plan, the way to bring whatever they come up with together. I have this plan that will take anyone's idea and integrate it into a bigger plan. Take your gifts and integrate it into a bigger plan. Take anything you want and integrate it into the bigger plan. Four levels. There's the inner you, the outer you, the inner group, and the outer group. The choice wheel, the flow wheel, the synergy wheel, the harmony wheel, all the wheels together. Tell me about your plan now. Do you got any wheels? Do you got levels? I doubt it. Hmm? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Oh, we have so many maps, so many maps, so many maps. We're going to use the maps to change our minds. We're going to use the maps to change our minds. Are you ready to change your mind? Are you ready for a new map? Well, Captain Swoop is here for you. And that's what this is about. It's about you and me and everybody else working together to make the world a beautiful place. Hmm, does that sound like a good part of the plan? Where love, love is the most important value. Welcoming, to welcome each other when paths are joined temporarily in time. This is a welcoming into the very secret plan. This is a conversation type. This is how we change, how we speak in the very secret plan. Captain Sweep came up with a card set called the Conscious Communication Card Set, where 72 of these conversation types are there, there, for you to use to transform how you communicate. <laughs> Does it get any better than that? Every piece of the plan helps us, helps you, helps everybody go forward. The most important part of that is communicating, learning how to consciously communicate, to move from conversation type to conversation type. Wait, I just, wait, 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 there, I did it. No, 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 wrong one, wrong one, wrong one. Sorry, sorry, no, 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 i.e. Captain Sweepum, is here to instruct you on how to communicate. And you may go to yourself, Captain Sweep, uh, that guy is freaking nuts. And I know that that's probably what a few of my friends or the characters in the very secret plan might think of Captain Sweep. And maybe that's why they're not participating to the degree they could. But now, now, there's so many things in place that are good for the secret plan to take off. Captain Sweep is going to bring them in a little bit more and maybe actually make the show. So right now, I think the only people who might watch this are going to be the 20 people in it. Because if they don't watch it, at some point you get tossed. <laughs> See, that's one thing about the secret plan. If you're not participating, you don't make it off the ship. Captain Sweep takes you out. So 
you got to be a little bit concerned. You just can't get away with whatever you want. Because at any moment, Captain Sweet might pull the plug. Boom! Oh. <sighs> you know, I just get excited sometimes. Have you ever seen this? <laughs> no, I'll probably guess. And the reason is sacred geometry is not a subject that is brought up much in this world. And right now, what we need is something intelligent. We need something divine. We need a divine design. And this, my friends, is a divine design. That's what? That's getting into step two. That's not step one. So step one's the start. This is the start. And this is the beginning of you coming into the very secret plan. Now you may come into the plan before the actual characters do, because I don't even know they're gonna watch this video. They don't watch anything that I give them. It's part of the comedy of the show, but it's a little bit irritating if you're actually trying to get something done, you know? So this is gonna be a bit of a wake up call because it's going to ask them to step up into their highest potential self it is going to ask them to step into their destiny. It is going to ask them to show the world what you want, what you're going to do about it, and how you're going to do it. And Captain Sweepums is there. So it's not quite just you. There's all these other people in the plan. And there's Captain Sweepums, who's like a trainer. Because I have to train people in the inflow matrix. They have to learn how to think different. They have to learn how to value things differently <clears throat> because we need a transformation. We need a true species-wide transformation and we're in the middle of it and Captain Sweep is participating, right? <laughs> Mm. <laughs> I've been waiting a long time for this. Long time. Because so many things tell you to stop. So many things tell you you can't bring your dreams into the world. So many things get Cap Sweet depressed. He's been, he's been depressed a long time. He's had to go through many setbacks. Up until now, the plan has been a little bit mm, questionable. Captain Sweet's been on his own a lot. Sometimes he interacts with some of the people in the plan and sometimes he doesn't. Sometimes there's other people that he interacts with. and Sometimes it goes well and sometimes, <coughs> I have to admit, it doesn't go so well. I know that's hard to believe considering what a great communicator I am. <sighs> But I just got to admit that sometimes it doesn't go well. And that's another part of the comedy. You know, things don't have to go well to be well. And the very secret plan, I must tell you, is a comedy. You got to have some laughter here. We want you to see the, the joy and sort of the ridiculousness of life. So that's my part, you know my part i want to change the nature of how we interact in the world i want there to be more fun more dancing more parties more people just having the greatest time of their life and so a big part of the very secret plan is something called planetary guardians and planetary guardians is like a global force of partiers they come together to change the world, but the only way they know how to do it is through a good party. You know, if they go into a battle, they have a party. If they go into the woods, they have a party. If they meet for a coffee, they have a party. If they, the planetary guardians are not like everybody else. They aren't like everybody else at all. That's where Miss Plum comes in. Now, I'm about to introduce you to 20 people, including me that are in the first part of the very secret plan because it comes in layers. 
first layer is a superhero team of 20 people, 20 people that I've met, 20 people that I've spent time with, 20 people that I believe in, 20 people that I feel hold a piece of the plan, hold something so unique that no one else can do it. So that's why they're in the plan. And Miss Plum, she's a big part of the very secret plan. She's like my muse. She's like somebody who I'm just in the room with her and I get excited. And when we go to a party, something magical happens where the whole room is, is just more beautiful, more good, more lovely, more fun, more sexy, more, more everything. Every time I've been somewhere with Miss Plum, something happens that's magical to me. And we go into this state, we go into a higher consciousness form where the music, the dancing, the people, it's the highest state I think that humans can get together. It's like ecstasy. Now, sometimes that's with, you know, help. And sometimes it's not. It just depends on the people and the field and the music and the state. But when all the people in the very secret plan come together, that's when the real magic happens. And that's what we're aiming for. Synergize, synergizing, synergy. And Miss Plum has a very, very secret way of doing that. But I'll let her describe it. So this is the end of Captain Sweep for now this week. I just wanted to give a bit of context. And now we gotta kinda find out who these characters are. Hmm.